hey guys what's up welcome back to our techies and in this video i gonna show you how to fix frp lock problem on motorola devices and this is a completely working method on 2018 so right now this is motorola c3 in my hand and let me first uh, connect it to with the wi-fi and let's check it out uh, and Okay, and basically the problem was that it, the phone was stuck on the uh, verify your Google account. So here it is. Uh, it's checking the connection right now, and and for this uh, process, you does not require anything uh, like uh, as uh, a OTG cable or like PC. You does not require that. You can easily uh, fix it from your phone only. So here it is is asking for the Google verify uh, verify your Google account and it's stuck on this screen There is no way to directly jump or uh, to bypass it So first of all uh, directly from the keyboard the setting and you require to uh, go to the text correction and personal dictionary and they require required to add some text here like something write something there and simply copy that text and share it click on this here and you will be see this option you require to select the message and in the message you require to type any kind of emergency number like 112 911 that's it so 112 right now i'm selecting and sending it and tap over the call button so here it is uh, the call button has been uh, opened uh, so you quite to type star has star has four six three six has star has and it will open star has star okay sorry has star has star so it will open this testing option then you require to open the user setting then back and it will open this setting so you can also uh, in some phones it uh, you can find the google id on here but in some phones it's not detect so if it's not there you don't worry just simply um, go to their apps and okay first of all uh, in the security uh, turn on the unknown sources make sure when it's on uh, the unknown sources is on then simply back and go to the app section and okay tap over the apps and find for a google apps or google only so let's see in some phones it is google app or in some phone it's only google so here it is uh, it's a google app and open the notification uh, here it is the okay notification just open the notification and on the notification then app setting and in the app setting simply go to the now cards and show cards and it will no thanks and you can find anything from your phone now now you require to open the chrome browser first so google chrome simply search chrome or google chrome you will find i require to search chrome okay you will find this chrome browser here and simply open it and accept it no thank you and now from here you require to search for the okay search for the uh, dpc tool that is the test dpc or type dpc tool only you will get the dif i am searching for test dpc and the, here it is the app so simply open it on any apk mirror website and it will be downloaded is you can download this app easily from there so just simply visit there and click over the uh, download download apk and and just wait for quite seconds and it will be open soon okay allow and okay and it's right now downloading so in some phones you can automatically uh, uh, option will appear appears to open this but in some phones it not detect so you require to search again back back and search for the again open the show cards and search for the downloads so you require to simply search for the downloads and in the download section you will get this uh, downloaded app dpc tool so install it call it and 
just uh, install the DP stage DPC and just simply open the tool and here you will see this setup as device owner select and as you can see I'm charging the phone right now let's remove the charger and let me show you something so here it's now charging has been removed encrypt and you will get this option please plug your charger and try again so I'm again plugging the charger because it always require 100% charge so here it is I'm charging phone right now and there is encrypt phone and the phone is now encrypting and the phone will automatically reboots so just uh, wait for it's rebooting so right now I'm fast forwarding for this video uh, fast forwarding right now and So the phones now gets on and and let's see so here it is uh, and this will option that is appear that is set up your device and test DPC so set up it and it's right now set up ping okay unfortunately so all these services stopped set up phone got it got it and here something like umbrella has been added uh, set up the phone and set up the phone set up phone okay and okay again set up phone it's uh, appearing again and again okay set up the phone again so I can't even back on this uh, there's no I can't even uh, press the back button let's uh, power it off and boot up again there's something uh, going wrong so again boot up the phone and let's see okay it's uh, okay it's off right now and let's turn on the phone and Okay, now the phone gets on and here add account skip so let's skip it and next and uh, finish finish so that's it so it's completely uh, you can see the Google account has been bypassed so now uh, from here you require to just uh, format the phone directly from here so the FRP locked completely now bypassed now we are going to completely remove it so erase everything now after erasing uh, when your phone will gets on you can add your uh, add your account and every all the Google Apps will be started so that's it so this is the complete uh, new method and it's still it's working on 2018 so now let's fast forward this video and check it out there
so now uh, let's rem remove the charger and let's on so here you can see I can easily uh, skip this set uh, Wi-Fi connecting setting so now next okay don't protect the phone and skip anyway okay and next so that's it it's done so this is the way in that way you can easily uh, bypass the FRP lock from your Motorola devices uh, yeah. so thanks for watching this if you like my video then please click on thumbs up and don't forget to like and subscribe this video thanks for watching this